Storm Hank is the latest extreme weather system to hit southern UK and it comes after a new study has confirmed that 2023 was the second hottest year on record. Sky UK science and technology editor Tom Clark has been looking at the data. The first named storm of the year, Hank, brought gusts of up to 100 miles an hour and the problems that brings. Flying scaffolding, cancelled trains, falling trees. Henk also dumped yet more rain across a country still soaked from last year's storms. Against this backdrop, it might seem hard to believe, but the Met Office has now confirmed 2023 was the UK's second warmest year on record. This is not just about individual days that are very, very hot. It's about the number of days in the year that are much warmer than average. And we've seen far more days warmer than average through the year. When it comes to weather, that warmth is energy. Energy that helped Storm Gerrit make a tornado over Manchester last week that gave October's Storm Babette a destructive boost and helped propel Kieran across the Atlantic onto our shores. And when it's not stormy, warmth intensifies heat waves. June 2023, a distant memory now, was the hottest on record and a full degree warmer than the previous June record. All of us experienced a year that was at least half a degree warmer than the 30-year average. And while this was the second warmest year for the UK as a whole, 2023 was the hottest ever recorded in Wales and Northern Ireland. Between the ups and downs in the weather, the warming trend is unequivocal, as is the cause. Carbon dioxide concentrations in the atmosphere are continuing to increase. And now they're the highest they've been for at least two million years. Warming and the impact it has on our weather isn't really up for discussion. The debate to be had is what we choose to do about it. It is very important that we do not get distracted by discussions about is it happening or isn't it not? Or is it human cause or is it not? We have to get on and start tackling climate change with far greater urgency and scale. If anything, the UK had it easy in 2023. Last year, it saw concurrent heat waves on five continents and is expected to be the warmest on record globally. A title that's forecast to be short-lived, a developing El Nino in the Pacific means 2024 is expected to be warmer still. How that affects the UK is uncertain, but could mean more of the weather extremes we're seeing right now. Tom Clark, Sky News.